What's up, everyone? My name is Daniel Diaz. Um, I was part of, luckily, the Wrap It Up Youth Songwriting Circle, um, along with Danica. And it was a huge success and a beautiful program that was born out of a question that um, we posed to Cultivate South Park. And we were just wondering what we were doing to reach out to folks who had been um, at home because of COVID and not had um, the opportunity to be outdoors. And we wanted to know if we were, if there was a way we can engage them artistically. Um, and we had a real emphasis or concern for the youth because we both had young, uh, younger people in our families that when you were at home doing uh, most of their schooling online and uh, the effects that that was having on them. And so um, together we got together with Cultivate and we were sharing ideas, bouncing ideas back and forth on how we could possibly engage the youth. And uh, this writing circle came up because Danica and both Danica and I are really into poetry and writing and hip hop. And so we thought it would be a really cool way to, um, to reach out to the youth and give them an opportunity to express themselves. There's some new people here. I mean, we got the adults here, so go ahead and start by just introducing yourself with your name, um, and then maybe something that has inspired you lately, whether that was a song, a movie, um, a person, a quote. So that's what we're gonna start off with. Our typical class, it's really fun and free flowing. Sometimes we go by a little creative curriculum where we warm up to a couple different words or something, randomized words, and then everyone will sit and write. And we do collaborative poetry. We learn about different poetic themes and words, um, just so they can expand their knowledge on poetry. But it's not limited to poetry. We also do songwriting and creative storytelling. So we'll go around and we'll create stories together as well and play some games. Um, we had this idea, they were all working on their own pieces and we had an idea, it would be really awesome to do an open mic. And so um, luckily we were able to team up with Rob from Southtown Pie, who lent us his space, um, his outdoor spacing, to get together and do this open mic. It was just amazing to see them um, just step into their light and, and do their thing and, and like we saw some kids who in the beginning were very shy and then gained a lot of confidence through the process and we're up there and we're like wow almost didn't recognize them they were like two completely different human beings um and a lot of it just gave me goosebumps some of it brings brought tears to my eyes um there was one kid in particular who uh was really shy and timid and really was uncomfortable with sharing and at the end just seeing the smile on his face really you know made, just made it all worth it for me all the work so um it was really awesome to see them all step in and working with them and talking to them on the phone and and uh having these really cool larger than life conversations with them that i never thought would take place um and finding out that i probably learned more from them than they did for me and i bet Danica feels the same way so it's just a really beautiful program. Um, I hope that we continue to do things like this for the youth and engage them. Um, I think that that's the best way. Uh, that's the, one of the best things we can do to ensure a bright future for them is just expose them to different um, opportunities and, um, and let them try all these different things and see what works for them and, and what they want to pursue. So yeah, it's time for me to wrap it up. Peace. <laughs> That was perfect. <laughs> that was perfect. <laughs>